Are you married but in love with another woman? Here's what to do, and pay close attention if you want to make sure no one gets hurt. Now, if you're in this sticky situation right now, no need to kick yourself too hard. It happens to a lot of men. And hey, I get it. Marriage is tough, and temptation never goes away. When your stress levels are high, temptations are strong. And it's easy to find yourself feeling affection towards another woman. And that's the beginning of what could be the doom of your marriage. Now, let's cut to the chase. When you're in this situation, there's really only one thing to do. It's the only way to guarantee a good outcome, where everyone, you, your wife, and the other woman, end up happier. If you try anything else, at least one of you will get hurt, and that's not a good outcome. So what's the only thing you can do? It's called the MPSP setup. Want to keep your marriage and this other woman at the same time? Then pay close attention to what you're about to learn in this video. Before we continue, do take two seconds to click the like button below. After you like this video, you'll see how the MPSP setup is the only clear way out of this maze you're in. Ready to get started? Then click like right now. Go ahead, we'll continue with the MPSP setup right after you do. Click like now. Are you done? Awesome. So here's what MPSP setup stands for. MP and SP stands for main plate and side plate, respectively. Here's what those two terms mean. Ever seen those circus performers who spin dinner plates on top of thin rods? They have to keep the plates spinning and perfectly balanced. If even just one of the plates falls, all the other plates fall as well, and everything comes crashing down. That's the perfect analogy to your situation right now. You're spinning two plates, your wife and the other woman. If one falls, the other will fall too, and chances are so will you. It's like this. If your wife finds out you're having an affair, she'll divorce you. That's bad. On the other hand, if you spent enough time and attention on your mistress, she'll start making demands you can't meet. Once you disappoint her, she'll get revenge by telling your wife and ruining your reputation. See the trap you're in? It would seem like there's no way out of the hole you're in. Unless, of course, you follow the MPSP setup. The only way to get a good outcome is when you treat your wife as your main plate and the other woman as your side plate. And you must keep them both spinning and in balance, happy and contented. Now, how do you do that? That's where the MPSP setup comes in. Here are the hard and fast rules of this special setup. 1. First, you must keep your marriage, your main plate, improving for years to come. 2. And secondly, you must keep your affair, your side plate, a sex-only setup. That way, your wife will be happy, your mistress will be happy, and you'll be happy, and nothing bad happens. See how it works? The trick is in achieving these two goals at the same time. After all, making a marriage better is by itself a lot of hard work. What's more, getting your mistress to agree to a sex-only relationship won't be easy. So what's a guy to do? Luckily, there's no need to fight this war on two fronts. Instead, you only need to use one technique on both women to achieve both goals. That's right, use this technique on your wife to make your marriage better, and then use the same technique to make your mistress agree to a sex-only relationship. It's that simple and powerful at the same time. So what's this technique all about? I call it the CYSR technique, and I'm about to show you how it works. For now, do take a moment to click the subscribe button below. If you learned something new and valuable in this video so far, do show your appreciation. Subscribe to this channel to get more relationship advice that works. After you do, I'll tell you all about the CYSR technique and how you can make two women happy at once. Sounds good? Then click subscribe right now and let's continue with the CYSR technique. Go ahead, do it now. Have you subscribed? Great, now let's continue. Let me tell you about the CYSR technique. It was introduced to me by my friend and mentor, the dating coach Derek Rake. And just in case Derek's name sounds familiar, it's because he's made a name for himself. He doesn't teach men to pick up women. Instead, he teaches them mind control, to understand the female mind completely. The rationale is simple. When you know how women think, you can influence how they act. And the CYSR technique is a good example of Derek Rake's mind control principles. Here's how it works. CYSR stands for Can You Stand the Rain? You know, like the song. And as the song goes, storms will come in relationships. The question is whether you can stand them. Only in the CYSR technique, you won't stand the rain, you'll bring the rain. 
That is, you will purposely inflict emotional stress on both women. This stress can come in the form of disagreements, disappointments, and discomfort. You get the idea. You do this in two instances. 1. First, you bring the rain whenever they display behavior you disapprove of. 2. And secondly, you bring the rain from time to time, just to shake things up. Now, that might not make sense to do. That's because there's a second component to the CYSR technique, and that is to be their sunshine after the rain. That means that every time you bring the rain, you give a balanced or greater amount of pleasure. And this pleasure can come in the form of reassurance, satisfaction, and affection. See how it works? These little emotional roller coasters do two very important things for you. One, first, it helps establish your dominance in both your relationships. They know you call the shots, not them. Two, and secondly, it pulls a hidden addiction trigger in their minds. It makes them feel not just attracted, but addicted to you. It's the same addiction they feel towards TV dramas, erotic novels, and gossip. It's not these things themselves that are addicting to women. It's the emotional roller coasters they take them on. If you could imagine your women feeling as addicted to you as they are to their favorite TV shows and books, that's what the CYSR technique does for you. Now, with your wife, you'll be using the technique to make your marriage a more exciting, satisfying place for her, and you do this for the rest of your life. With the other woman, you'll use it to make her agree to a sex-only relationship. If she insists on being something more than just friends with benefits, then you bring the rain, and you bring the rain until she gives in. And after that, you be the sunshine and reward her good behavior. See the magic? It's just one technique, and you achieve both your goals. And so, when you're married but in love with another woman, here's what to do. Use the CYSR technique, bring the rain, and be the sunshine after the rain. Now, speaking of the CYSR technique, here's a bit of trivia about it. Its emotional roller coaster aspect actually has a proper name in applied psychology. It's called fractionation, and its addiction building effect is well documented. As far as mind control goes, fractionation is one of the most useful techniques you can ever learn. And you'll need it if you want to keep your plates spinning happily for years to come. So here's what I'll do for you. In a moment, a link will come up inside this video. If you click on that link, you'll be sent to a special online masterclass on mind control. And that masterclass will be hosted by, of course, the master, Derek Rake. In this masterclass, Derek will teach you everything about fractionation. You'll learn why it works and how to start using it today to take charge of all your relationships. And you'll need that control. It's super important. Remember, anything less than the outcome outlined in this video, and you're asking for trouble. To make everything work out harmoniously, you must use fractionation on both of them. So go ahead, make it work. Click the link and join Derek's online masterclass to see how. Click the link now.